so many things here, nooks and crannies, that you know they're always coming across new things that they haven't seen. You know, and, and there's we have so many different things that some of the kids get attracted to the compost. Some of the kids like working with the worms, and some of the kids hate working with the worms. You know, so there's enough different things that grabs kids' interest. Um, I like the turtles of the beard dragon. Like, I really like. The warm room, like reptiles, are like my favorite animal. This is a dwarf hamster. His name is O. Henry, and we just recently got him from a student who gave him to to Mr. Hammond. This is our indoor compost pile. You can see all our worms in there. So if um, we do, you know, we put our old recyclable compost in here, and then we use the worms. For uh, again, it's a type of animal that, that kids can study, but also we use it for you know feeding different. different Anna, he, I mean, this is Java. He's a pixie frog, and he's been here in this school since I was in kindergarten. How many? What's your estimate of how many animals or creatures you got in here? It depends on what you call animals. So the reason I'm saying an estimate of, of, of numbers because. We teach animals, you know, animals are vertebrates and invertebrates, and we raise, you know, we raise our own crickets. So we have thousands of, we have thousands of crickets. We raise our own, and you'll love this, hissing cockroaches. So we have thousands of, of hissing cockroaches. This is a chinchilla. He's really, really soft if you feel him. Fat frog in the, the warm room, and he pees on a lot of people, and there's a list over there of when the, the elementary school kids come, because he pees on a lot of people. It's like the kids they get, the yeah. yeah. And <laughs> last, last year, I got bit by a pregnant gerbil in my finger. Oh, wow. Yeah. This was an old, um, this was the old metal shop at the vocational school. This used to be there. Uh, there used to be a big industrial hood here for, for exhausting noxious fumes, so. Instead of no noxious metal fumes, it now exhausts noxious mammal fumes. Yeah, there's chickens. Hold their, hold their wings. They kind of they clean their cages, and they're kind of hard to hold. <laughs> and are those are, are those one of the chickens that <laughs> are they're hard to hold and they're hard guys, to catch? These guys been with me since 1980. Uh, he got hit by a car. We, we glued his shell together, so he's been with us for a while. Oh, see the animals, help them feed them. Just enjoy it. Or later.